Each of you is with Cynthia Michael from Greedy Productions, bringing you my 388 podcast. And like always, I'm going to speak very loudly, very, very clearly, and very slowly, in case you don't understand me. Also, I want to talk to you, my best not to be too hard doing this audio podcast recording as well, not to cause any audio feedback as well. And finally, and finally, if you're under 18, this podcast will retain your adult language if you're under 18. So anyway, so, so anyway, with this and everything else out the way, let's get into the latest, let's get into the topic of this episode. So basically, oh, I just finished watching the, uh, the season premiere of Empire Season, uh, uh, the first episode of Empire Season season 5. So basically, I'm going to try to keep this, about, this review short. So anyway, it turns out, Turns out it's been two years. Turns out it's been two years to, 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 since the Lions lost Empire. <laughs> lost Empire. Cookie and Lucius, during these two years, Cookie and Lucius had, had, put, uh, had, 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 had been trying to, 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 they had been trying to get, to get in, uh, Empire back for Eddie in her, in his, uh, Eddie in her, uh, Eddie in his evil second wife. So they bought, uh, but, uh, but they spent a lot of money on trying to get Empire back, so basically left them broke. So basically they fight to try to get Empire back, but has left them fight Financially broke. Uh, financially broke. So anyway, so anyway, here, so anyway, so basically, Lucy coaches are basically all out there. Don't really have any money. Uh, don't really have any money left. You know, because they're trying to get Empire back for for uh, their fight. This two, their two year fight to try to get Empire back from that bastard Eddie in his in his second life. So anyway. So anyway, so anyway, Hakeem, did got shot, but the but but Hakeem did got shot, but he survived. But due to but the damage was done. Turns out when Hakeem lost a part of his love, when he got shot by by the white boys, by his new white boy friend, his father during the whole inner season. Uh, the whole end of season four, but so basically, cause he loses his love, cause uh, cause of how he loses uh, upon his love, it's hard to hit the rap, rap, uh, it's hard to hit the, uh, it's hard to hit the rap while you know while him coughing up blood and shit. So basically, Hakeem is a little free, low. You know, he's still alive for the gun time. Nobody else got hurt and hurt and whatnot. Him and Tatiana are now living together with their two children. Turns out that, turns out that, you know, turns out that, you know, Hakeem and, Hakeem and Tatiana are, still, are living together after the whole gunshot thing, blah, 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 blah. So anyway, as, as for Andre, Andre, Somehow, somehow, somebody tied tied the murder of Nika to to Andre. So therefore, with the help of Thirsty, Thirsty, you know, so with Andre with the health thing, they decided Andre got two years in prison for you know, for killing you know, for you know, for accidentally killing you know, accidentally killing Nika. So basically, you know, Thirsty got the the charges dropped to as of murder, but accidentally murder murdering Nika, aka Boo. Kitty. So basically, so basically, RJ, 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 you know, RJ is in jail after two years. So he's been two years. Uh, he's been in jail for two years after killing Nika. But in jail, in jail, RJ has has uh, has found some interview. Had uh, had made a friend who had some dirt on Eddie. So basically, so basically, he, so basically, he gave the information to his mother and father, and he basically they tried to they tried to uh, you know. So, you know, they can use that information to black no any and get Empire back. For, for, uh, get Empire back. But anyway, the only one who seems to be happy with their with their uh, in this two year period is Jamal. Jamal has been living in London. He's in London, you know, he started his own record label, even though it's not making enough money. He found new he's got a new man named Khalil who Khalil is some shit. <laughs> you know, so basically an odd line family like, like you know, he's a race for the drama though, so basically he's happy he's happy with, he's happy in London, you know, he found he got a new boyfriend. You know, he has his own label, even though he's not making no money, but, you know, he just happy, he just, uh, even though he won't say, say it, you know, he just happy to be away for his family and all this bullshit drama. So, anyway, 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 so
So anyway, anywho, so basically, uh, so basically, you know, Cookie, uh, Cookie loses to Father Eddie with the, uh, for, uh, Father Eddie, uh, so basically Cookie loses to Father Eddie with the information about, you know, about him, talk about the information they got from, uh, for, uh, for Andre, uh, friend in jail that tells her that, that Eddie's been skidding profits from the Empire since he took over, uh, over, uh, Empire, so basically, he's been skidding money from Empire, so basically, loses. Lucy and Cookie said we know about your secret account and all that shit just getting money from Empire. So basically we said we gonna get you we gonna get you to tomorrow to to you to reside the Empire and you know and turn oh and you know and, and turn over oh uh, like to and let, and turn out you know and turn over all the shit all the shit of the you know, Empire. So basically any so what is that? So basically, you know, Eddie was not. So basically, so basically, Lucius and Cookie had Eddie in a, in a, really had Eddie. So basically, then Eddie had no choice but to do what Cookie Lucius said. So basically, you like, you know, so basically, before he did, you know, he told his ex, his second wife, his second ex-wife, that you know that Lucius Cookie got me this time. So basically, like, you know, got us this time. So basically, like, you know, tell his life is over. So basically. You know, any second wife was not uh, was not was to uh, get an empire. You know, was not happy about uh, about Eddie's blackmail situation because it was turned out for the last two years. Turned out uh, Eddie's second wife and Becky was the one truly running empire for the last two years. Eddie was just a figurehead. Uh, 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 Eddie was uh, why Eddie was just like a figurehead and shit like that. But blah, blah. so basically, Eddie uh, so basically Eddie. Eddie was here, so Eddie was dropped and tried to and tried to push up on his second wife, but his second wife was not trying to hear shit and push and push Eddie away from her. But he ended up bumping his head on the table, therefore he started to bleed for his head. My bump, when Eddie bumped his head on the table, he blood started to gush from his head. So basically, he was really bleeding for his head. So basically. So basically, instead of her, instead of her, so instead of any second wife helping him, helping, helping, helping him, helping him, helping, you know, helping him, you know, try to, try to stop bleeding, she let him bleed out and, and let him bleed out and, uh, and die right there in Lucius, Lucius is throwing us off, uh, uh, right there in the office that was, what was Lucius. So basically, since Eddie is dead, since Eddie is dead, so therefore, therefore, before before he get you, before he did you, he, he was promised, you know, Lucius and Lucius and Cookie was not, you know, didn't get, get that empire, because, you know, because of Eddie, you know, because Eddie died before, you know, before he did, he was supposed to, so basically, so basically, because of Eddie's death, you know, Lucius and Cookie did not get, 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 get control back the empire, so anyway, Jamal, or so, Jamal finally came, came, came to the house and whatnot, whatnot, and I told them that, you know, uh, you know, getting a little pet for us and say, you guys don't need empire, you guys can just start over, so basically, so basically, after taking it, after hearing tomorrow's advice, so, after hearing tomorrow's advice, they, so Cookie and Lucy found a new artist, and they tried to start, they uh, start a new, uh, as you start a new, a, a new record label, a new record label to, you know, you know, it's time to start over with a new record label. So basically, you know, you know, in order to get a, get Empire back, so you know, start new to get that what, what square there. So basically, so basically, that's pretty much what, what's been going on in the last two years at Empire, Empire. So anyway, so anyway, so anyway, so so anyway, that's pretty much all. This is pretty much all I'm just going to say about this. I just want to talk about the main important things about this first episode of Empire. So anyway, that's pretty much what's happening. You know, you know, you know, Cookie, Cookie, Cookie. You know, Eddie's dead. You know, before Eddie died. You know, Cookie, Cookie, uh, Lucy almost had Eddie back, but wasn't for Eddie's second ex-wife. You know, let him die. You they would have had Empire back right now, blah blah blah. You know, Haki is a little, you know, Haki left the part of his lung when he got shot by, by, by his white homeboy's father, Lucy's father, you know, therefore, 
therefore he's uh, therefore he, therefore affecting his career, his rap career, and also and also and also making him tripped out ever. So basically, you know, Hawk he's been having some problems ever since he had you know had some physical problems and some mental problems since he got shot by white boy white boy so uh, wasted father and whatnot. Anyway, OJ's in jail after, you know, after, uh, after, ki after being the key to accidentally killing the Mika. So basically, first he got him, got him two years, you know, based on his mental health and whatnot. So basically, you know, you know, OJ's in jail, all, all getting to that and shit. Jamal, Jamal, the only one, the Jamal is like, you know, it's not really to, it's not, uh, it seems like the most the, uh, it's the only happy person in the life family because you know he's been living in London. You know, you know he's not with he's not been in he's not been in, in the family drama and shit. So basically, he's happy, he's happy and whatnot. But he's just still not saying that you know, you know, I need to get you to change the family. That you know, I I, I I like you as my family, all, but you know, I just can't fuck with y'all in the drama. So basically, he you know, you know, he's the only one. Happy of, <laughs> she's like uh, Jamal is the only one uh, was happy with his situation as it is right now. So anyway, that's pretty much what happened. So basically, I'm not going to speak about where, uh, anything else that happened in this episode. So basically, you guys guys you have to watch it for yourself. So anyway. So anyway, this is like always, like always, this, uh, like always, you know, what you, uh, you know, you know, this is Michael, sign off, one.